Is there any way I could do treatment? I'm screaming now. She want to do treatment now? How many days? What's up, YouTube? You clicked the title. You read the page. That means it is reaction video time. Some lady bugging out in court and immediately regrets it. Listen, I don't understand why people play games in court. It's just certain places you just should not f around, and court is one of them. Why people play with these judges? These judges got your life right there. Like, why are you playing with them, man? Listen, subscribe for the vibe. I don't even want to waste too much time. Let's get to it. Do you think threatened you or coerced you in any way for you to enter into a plea? No. No. All right. Counsel, you can please part of your client. Yes, I'd like to direct your attention to June 15th, 2023 and June 22nd, 2003. Did you fail to appear for a probationary instruction? Yes. And additionally, while on probation, you did accrue a new charge, correct? Yes. Satisfied, Your Honor. Well, at least she's being honest, you know, but it's like, why you didn't go to court? I feel like, yo, I feel like stuff like that is avoidable. Like, why you in trouble, yo? Because I, I, I got in trouble this-ish, and I just didn't go to court. Like, that's just a stupid reason. The court is also satisfied the plea is knowing, voluntary, factually accurate. The court will accept your plea <clears throat> to the probation violations. Enter a plea of guilty based upon your, I'm sorry, enter a probation violation based upon your plea of guilty. And that would be technical violations one, two, three, four, and five. And counsel? Your Honor, I saw the recommendation for 60 days jail. I asked that my client get credit for the time that she's been in since December 1st. I'd ask that uh, it run concurrent with the admonishment that she's received from the charge that she just took a plea on. And then furthermore, she did ask that uh, during this time in custody, if possible, she would like the opportunity to be tethered to treatment. Thank you, Judge. All right, Ms. Bojack, did you request um, to be tethered to, treat to treatment while you've been on bond? Yes, um, just to try to um, have time. I mean, I don't think I personally need treatment, but um, I know that that was something that I asked for when I first got arrested. So, um, what? Just listen to your lawyer, okay? You you got a public defender. He's doing. He seems like he's doing a pretty good job. She talking about. She basically just went against everything he just said. I don't think I personally need treatment. Clearly, you need treatment because you're missing court dates, things that's avoidable. I'll, I'll do the days. Um, I'll do whatever it takes, but I just, I really just want to uh, get home. Okay, ma'am, let me ask you a couple questions. Number one, if you don't think you need treatment, why did you ask to go to treatment? Um, I was trying to uh, have, like, the days made up i don't know if it i don't really know because <laughs> it, it, it well, ma'am you, ma you asked for treatment so why did you ask for treatment uh, yeah. yo i don't know whether to say she's stupid because she being too honest or like because it's like you want a person to be honest but this is now you just being too honest and you look crazy i'm sorry um, to not have jail time. Oh, that's what I thought. Okay. So, and you don't think you need treatment given your, given, given what's been going on with you the last year, you don't think you need treatment. Honestly, no, I really found myself in here. Um, I've been spending time with myself. Um, I don't know. I just, I don't feel like I need a, a, a guy or anything. I don't, I don't know. I just, I just want to uh, get going. I'm like, well, man, the way you've been going on life, not a great start. How old are you? Yo, I'm screaming. Yo, this judge, I fuck with her. This judge got some black in her. She got an attitude problem. I like that. 25. 25. And now you have three drug-related convictions. Three. Your under advisement status is revoked. You had an opportunity to not have your possession charge on your record, and you didn't do a darn thing with probation. Not at all. You just ghosted us. I know. I just... 
if I get probation this time, I, I, I told myself like, you know, it would be at least six months that that's all I would really need to get like clean. And I, you know, by summertime I'd be, you know, working please by summertime it's gonna be worse because everybody gonna be outside you gonna want to be outside with the with all the activities that's going on so you ain't going to get clean this judge is seeing right through her thing i, I really want to get a car um but aside from the job thing just you know i want to draw and make music and i don't know i just want to do things for myself and i don't I like coffee again. Um, I don't know. Just things I, I've been drinking a lot of water. I, there's just a lot of things I wasn't doing before that like I've been doing since I've been in here. Um, so I haven't. Hey, ma'am, ma'am. Part part of the part of the concern, right? Is when you get out, how are you going to continue to do stuff, right? That's part of what treatment is, and you don't think you need treatments. So I've, I've been to court seven times. I've been to treatment like seven times. I really, I just, I don't know. I know. I, know. I mean, listen, if she, if she been to treatment seven times, she need another type of treatment because that treatment ain't working. I know how to work the program. I know to go to a meeting when I need to. I need, I know there's just I know. So you go through the motion. You go through the motions. So you just go through the motions. You don't really receive what it is that you're getting. I really think I've learned a different way I've been incarcerated this time, man. But, um, it's, I, I don't know. It's just, it feels different. It feels really different. I'm well, here's what Judge, we're ready to uh, hear the sentencing. Uh, we are ready to proceed, Judge. Okay. Yes, no, man, you're not getting probation. I can tell you that much. The court's going to, on uh, 23405, the court's going to adopt the recommendation, revoke probation, close the case without improvement, $50 probation violation fee, 60 days jail. On um, 23... You see, you should have agreed to treatment. Now she's like, yeah, you're definitely not getting probation. 60 days jail. 739, the court's going to adopt the recommendation. Your under advisement status is revoked. Your probation is revoked. $50 probation violation fee, 60 days jail. The court will know that that will be served concurrent. Um, and then the court's going to also order on um, 232479, the court's going to order 93 days jail. Yo, look how she looking, yo. She looking like, oh my goodness, if I would've known now, I would've just took treatment for the eighth time. <laughs> Credit for your 15 days. That's consecutive with two three seven three nine and two three four zero five. The lawyer looking like, oh well, I tried to save you, Slim. He like, I tried to save you, Slim. You didn't want to listen. And the court will suspend your fines and costs on that on this matter. What? <laughs> Any questions, counsel? No, Your Honor. Any questions, ma'am? So, uh, how, how many days? Well, 60 on your probation violations plus 93 plus 15. So, that's going to be, I can tell you exactly what that is, ma'am. Is there any way I could do treatment? Well, I'm screaming now. She want to do treatment now. How many days? Yo. 138 days. Is there any way I could do treatment? Yeah, you, did, you told this court you don't need treatment. Okay, I I, 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 I. No, you just you told this court the only reason you said that is because you don't want to do the jail time. No, that's so, not. You can do the jail time. I'm screaming, yo! And she's on something. Well, she in jail, so she can't be on something. Her, her, the elevator don't go all the way up to the top. It stop at like 15. The highest floor is 30. It stop at 15. Cause you, like, I can't make this up. You just said, now nah, I don't need treatment. I just didn't want to do jail. Who's who is that honest? Like, whoever is that? And then the lawyer had a good thing going for himself. That's probably why he got pissed off. It was like, man, forget this dummy. Ma'am, I'll do treatment. I, quite frankly, ma'am. 
with your um, lengthy warrant status and you're absconding from probation, I'm not sure that you would not abscond from, from your treatment provider. Ma'am, I really, I can't, I can't do 130 days. Yeah, you said you didn't need treatment. I do. The problem was, when I went to share, I, I need help with housing when I get out of here. I, I'm sure that need. I'm sorry? I need help with housing when I leave here. Um, you know, I, I have my... Okay, I, I need that talking in the background to please stop. This is a nice little feisty judge. But yeah. My record is a, my court recorders indicated our record is a mess because of all the talking in the background. And what was that, Ms. Bolchak? Hey, I really don't I I think I need treatment instead. I Ma'am, you're very clear. You've been to treatment seven times and you don't need treatment anymore. No, I, I do. No I have a program. No, I, I I got a little ahead of myself. I that, no, I I got a little honest. I got a little too honest, and I should have lied to you. That's what I asked for when I first came in, um, because I do have a drug judge potentially. Uh, judge, I know that potentially she might be asking for some sort of mental health treatment, but I understand the stock. It does need to be moved along, so if necessary, uh, we have to have the matter recalled later in the morning to potentially have it reevaluated. But I understand the docket does need to move along, Your Honor. Yo, he over. He like, yeah, let's go. Let's let's, let's wrap this up. Thank you, Judge. Thank you. Ms. Bolchak, I'm not ordering treatment for you at this point. Because you stated that you don't need treatment. And you only asked for it so that you didn't have to do jail time. Given that, and the fact that you had absconded from probation with this court... The court has concerned that you're not going to abscond from treatment. So at this point, 138 days is what you're going to serve, ma'am. And she not wrong for that. That's on her, man. Y'all subscribe for the vibe.